guys, it's Toro from my Lero's Tips and Tricks. And of course, when there's a new update, there's a new video for me. Um, we're now having update version 1.8.10. And as always, we're just going through the um, things they updated. So starting off with the first point, we have um, the enhancement of the skills of Glenn, Molassa, Christian, Divine Spirit, and Dark Spirit. Um, let's look at Glenn first. See what they did to Glenn. Uh, yeah. Oh, all right. Um, okay then. What the heck? I can't look at it. What the heck is this? Oh, my God! I'm so retarded. I'm sorry. Um, <coughs> I think they updated this one. Maybe they. Yeah, I think the increased HP is better now, and uh, I can't tell about this one. But, of course, they um, increased their skill, which is pretty good, I think. Because, especially Melasa and those Dark Heroes, like Divine Spirit and Dark Spirit, they were not good compared to, like, the other heroes. So, yeah, that's... I think that was kind of mandatory to do that, so... Yeah. Then second point, limited the guild XP will be obtained by challenging the guild raid boss every day. So what I think that means is that I think they decrease the amount you get for attacking him. I do not have enough um, gems right now to test it because I literally don't have 40 gems, which kind of sucks, but yeah, whatever. Um, yeah, so, I don't know why that is, but whatever. Then the third point is that you can check your last rankings when you go to your arena tab. So, yeah, there you see, last ranking, and last ranking. So, I have no last ranking for the free team up because I didn't think I participated last time. But you can see yours. Yeah, so that's about it. Then... They got, now the Guild War rewards of qualifying rounds will be awarded before the final start starts, sorry. Um, like, I noticed that, because, oh yeah, so, yeah, that was something I want to show later on, but whatever. So, I got, like, Guild War rewards today, even, because, even before, like, the final was starting, because it is starting in three hours, but I still got 1.5 grams of, um, Guild War points, which is a little something, I think that's pretty good, so I'm completely fine with that. And now we're coming to the actual event. So, what I think, and I think I've expressed that sometimes before, is I'm not a fan of fusion events, but it's whatever, and yeah, so you can now uh, repeatedly gain rewards sent by your in-game mail from fusing in Creation Circle at most 10 times during the event, so you can do... Um, 10 5 star summons or fusions and 10 6 star fusions and you'll get this the reward you can see right here like they of course put some monster stuff in it because they want to boost this feature definitely a good thing so my progress in this event I'm just going to show you is I went to the creation circle and I had spare material for uh, is that Norma? yeah so for Norma and I'm of also saving for my um, uh, 6 or Shira. For that, I need my um, 5 star Christian. Other than that, I got my all my materials set. So, I need right now 2 more of um, the Christians, then I can get another 5 star accomplishment. And then I have those, those, and I can do this and make a 6 or Shira. Um, yeah, so that's about it. That's all I need. And, um, other than that, they only did during the event, the actual loot of campaign is doubled. The show of loot stay unchanged. So, yeah, they doubled your loot income. I think that's, that's something that's helpful for new players. So, why not? I mean, oh, damn. Uh, yeah, that's pretty useful, so whatever. Then, of course, they changed the value packages. I'm just quickly show them. They're not interesting for me, but maybe for you. 
So you can now obtain shards, 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 and profit orbs and gems. So whoever's interested in that, go for it. Other than that, they only fixed some bugs and made some optimizations. And yeah, that's about it. And I'll see you next time. Peace.